Hi there, this is Captain Rex, and I'm going to introduce you to the Texas Rattler. I'm going to show you the virtues of the Texas Rattler right quick, and the fact that we do have still have the uh, light reflecting eyes, which I first put on jig heads back in 2003. They're still the loudest rattling jig heads that there are on the market. So, and the uh, wild eyes actually move around. They do make a little rattling sound on their own. They're very realistic looking. But the main thing I want to show you here today is uh, how other plastics rig on, on the Texas Rattler. And then we'll do a little comparison with the Rockport Rattler. The Rockport Rattler Quick Lock that I made was an adjustable locking device. So you could get more mileage out of your plastics by getting different grips on it by adjusting your locking device. The current owners of the Rockport Rattler that I sold the company to have made it a one strike and you're out jig because now when you get a fish strike the quick lock is going to cut that and you can't thread that thing back on there because it's split. You had got to throw out, put on a new plastic because because the quick lock does not move. So what we've done is uh, we have put the U-lock which is a uh, locking device, a rubber locking device called the U-lock that has 500 percent gripping power and then when the plastic goes in front of it it locks and it's easier to thread. The difference is, is it won't slip. It just won't slip. Okay and let's do a gulp. Okay with the gulp here's a Rockport Rattler okay and we're gonna pull on it and you'll see how it just slips and when you get water underneath there it's gonna slip on it more okay you got some slipping going on there. Here's the Texas Rattler it's not going to slip. It doesn't slip. Okay, so you've got a U lock provide you the best grip ever on a rattling jig head. That's a Texas rattler.